guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Marisa. How is everyone today? So, I just want to say thank you to everyone who wished me a very happy birthday yesterday. I really appreciate it. And a huge thank you yet again to Stacey Nicole from Artsy Fartsy Lovers. That girl literally streamed about an hour and a half yesterday just for my birthday. Um, that is something I will never forget. That was amazing, awesome. She is awesome, sweet, so nice. I, I can't even, there is no words to say how grateful I am. You literally made my day. Like, you have no idea how much you made my day, Stacy. So thank you again. Thanks to all who are newly subscribed. How are you? I hope all is well. So today I got a delivery. It is April 30th. I got a delivery and I am officially 50. Yay! 50 and fabulous. But anyway, so for my birthday, I did order quite a few things and this is only part of the order. This is going to be my official review of the Deco Art uh, pouring acrylic. So this is one kit. I ordered this is called the brights kit so what is this coastal waters chartreuse lemon zest and flamingo okay and those are those colors I did order a few other kits um, I think one is called tropical the other one is called molten lava and I think there was a third one but I cannot remember I also just ordered today some folk art pouring acrylics um, I don't know how those are gonna be but I am trying them I ordered uh, four different colors and the price wasn't bad it was like $7.99 a bottle for eight ounces and then I had 20% off from Michaels so that wasn't bad just to try it um, and I wanted to get four colors just so I can make something really nice with it you know and I also ordered other paints um, off of Amazon. They're called American Crafts. So, and those colors are really beautiful. Um, so we shall see. Those are all like pre-mixed pouring acrylics. So today on this beautiful 8x10 canvas, I am going to do a flip cup. Okay. And yeah, so that's what we're going to do just to try these out. And uh, we'll see how these work. You know, hopefully. I mean, Deco Art is a pretty good paint, but let's see how their kind of premixed pouring acrylics are. I wanted to wait for the other colors, but you know what? This is more than enough paint to do a cute little, um, I was about to say look, like it's doing makeup. Uh, you know, so a, a cool uh, flip cup. So let's try that. And I just wanted to show you really quick uh, how these dried. So I poured on these. Um, to make it the back and now I'm going to just going to fix kind of these edges here So these dried really cool and I really like the way they all came out. I have to say I Really love the way all these came out. I am not mad at it at all and I did buy um because one of the only stores open is Rite Aid. Um, they have like this little dollar section. And so for 80 cents, I got this um, ice tray. And I am going to do try doing a pour with this. I'm going to fill up all the little holes and kind of do a pour like that. That will be probably one of the next videos. But today, let's get started and do a flip cup, okay? All right, guys, I will be back in a minute.
Okay, guys, I am back. So, you know what, Deco Art? I am confused. Um, you said pre-mixed pouring acrylics. These were so thick, I had to use so much paint um, that they're, like, almost empty already, which is kind of ridiculous. Um, they're not expensive because it's Deco Art. Really pretty colors. You know, this is my official review. Now, with pre-mixed pouring acrylics is supposed to be a medium in them there and there was no like directions like um oh what other paint was it the pouring masters that was confusing as well because it said pre-mixed pouring acrylics but then it comes with a medium so that was weird okay now these were so thick like yes the colors are pretty um yeah, I, you know, it didn't do much, I'm going to be honest with you. I was not expecting, like, cells or anything, but this paint was so thick. I don't understand how could it be pre-mixed deco art. I don't understand. So, before I waste any more paint, the next time I try these, I am going to try them with some Floetrol, because obviously... Deco Art does not understand what pouring acrylics means. Um, they have to be more fluid Deco Art. So, yeah. Um, you know, when I was pouring it in the cup, I was like, oh boy, here we go. Um, but, you know, I just want to try it without anything because it does say pre-mixed. Um, so, you know, some of these companies don't get it right, uh, but that's okay. So, um, this is like regular paint, you know, it's like uh, more fluid. It's kind of like the consistency of the Artist Loft acrylic flow paint, where you have to use a uh, pouring medium, but it is just like a little bit more fluid than regular like tube paint, okay? Yes, the colors are very, very pretty. Um, but yeah, this is like, you know, this is definitely going to be something I'm going to pour over. And probably when I try it with the flow troll, I'll probably just use the same um, canvas uh, in order to not waste canvas. Um, but yeah, you know, I'm going to try these again with the flow troll um, and see what happens, you know, because obviously they need, it needs a medium. So that's my, that's my official review. You know, paint are pretty, the colors are nice, way too thick. Um, I was not expecting cells or anything, you know, uh, with these pre-mixed things, but girl, deco art. This is not a pouring acrylic. It is not, okay? Um, yeah, you definitely need to use a medium. So that's my review. You know, this is kind of like, for me, dull. Uh, you know, like I said, the colors are pretty, but, you know, this is bad. Bad, 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 bad. But again, you know, I never had a flip cup do this. This is like, it was just thick. Um, so, yeah. All right, so that's my official review. Um, I do like the colors. Um, they're affordable. But, you know, I just suggest if you're going to try them um, to use a pouring, you're going to have to use a pouring acrylic. Uh, a pouring acrylic. You're going to have to use um, a pouring medium. And, you know, try Flow Troll. Um, you know, there's many out there. Deco Art has their, oh, maybe I'll try the Deco Art pouring medium. You know what? But I'll do both. Maybe I'll do two paintings in the next one. I do have a big bottle of the Deco Art pouring medium, which is not a bad pouring medium. So I may do two, um, paintings next time. I'll re, uh, re-pour with this guy and then I will use a flow troll in the Deco Art. That's what I'll do. Okay. All right, guys, so I hope you enjoyed this video. You know, please subscribe, give me a like, uh, turn your notifications, share the video. And yeah, I really appreciate you guys watching, and I will see you in the next one, guys. Bye. Hey, guys, so I am back for a minute. Um, well, your friend Marisa here is quite an idiot. No wonder these were so thick. I was so excited to open these paints up that I clearly just ignored the very fact that, I mean, all right, so my camera is not focusing. I am going to read it. <sighs> Use one-to-one -one ratio deco art pouring medium to paint for best results. Okay, so that whole video I did, my fault, my bad, but I just wanted to show you really quick 
this is the neon um, kit. I think I also got the tropical. I'm not sure. I think one of the sets were um, they were out of stock. I think I got the tropical as well. And this is the molten lava, which I'm actually really, really, really uh, excited for to try because these colors are really beautiful. Um, yeah, so I made a big mistake, and so, but now I know, and I actually, it's, I am, because I, I was actually more excited to use this, uh, these, this color set here, so I have a huge bottle still, probably more than halfway full of the actual decor pouring medium, so in the next video... I'm actually just going to try it with the deco art and see what happens because it's its own brand. Let's see what happens um, because I did actually waste quite a bit of paint, okay, with with uh, this painting here due to the fact that I'm an idiot. <laughs> I mean, this is literally like like about halfway done. Um, yeah, that one has a little more. Yeah, that kind of sucks, but um, you know what? It's all good. And um, these are the paper pads that came from, this is only one-sided, but look at how beautiful these are. So I just wanted to show you that really, really quickly. Um, yeah, look how beautiful. Uh, I, I actually don't mind the one-sided pages because, you know, if there's something else that's cool on the other side. It's like I don't even know what side to use. But this is vintage. It's by a, um, a brand called Color Book. And then this is actually really cool. It is spray paint. I am a New Yorker and I know pl plenty of street artists and that I thought was so awesome. And these were really cheap. Um, I believe these were only like $5.99 each. Wow, that's kind of cool. Anyway guys, so I love that. Very cool. Um, yeah, so that is that. Um, so I just wanted to come back on really quick and say I'm an idiot. Yeah, I can admit it. I'm an idiot. <laughs> right? So next video, I'm going to try with a deck award and maybe I'll try with a flow troll as well. All right, guys, I'll see you next time. Bye. Can't wait.